Or watching us from this is the sweet action podcast. Yes, sir. Yes, yes sir. sir. <laughs> Yo, what is up, guys? Welcome back to the sweet action podcast. If you're a new or returning viewer, we appreciate you guys for coming kicking with the best crew as always. You got myself, Carlos. Next to me, I got the homegirl, Kelsey. Across from me, I got the homie, George. And in front of me, as always, you guys love him. You guys hate oh, him. It's the homie, John. Like, guys, you know, we always got the best fucking teammate in the world. Got the homie, Xavier, doing it, holding it down as always. He's back in Bora Bora. <laughs> He's back in Bora Bora. He's back in Bora Bora. He'll be he back next week. <laughs> but guys, as always, Sweet Action only brings on the best of the motherfucking best. You know, we got out here future Ballon d'Or winners. Facts. We got future out here Golden Boy winners. Facts. Fuck. We got out here putting people that can put Mexico on the World Cup and give them a chance Facts. to win the fucking World Cup. <laughs> Vamos there you go. Bro, please. Bro, please. <laughs> but guys, we got the most fucking talented people out here, bro. Ballers. Straight out fucking ballers. If you guys want to make sure you, and you want to learn how to be a fucking baller, bro, get to that high level. These boys are up here, bro. And these boys are up next. It's the one and only Bogart. And of course, his dynamic duo, the one and only Nico. <laughs> Baby, yo, what is up, guys? <laughs> Welcome, Hello. Hello. Appreciate it, bro. Nah, I got you guys, bro. Uh, we're happy you guys are here, man. It's an honor to have you guys here. As always, bro, everyone that we bring on, we're fucking huge fans of them. We support them. And we, we love what you guys do, bro. You know, the content out there is dope. And we're here, bro. We by here to give this interview a fucking go. So without breaking the do, bro, how you guys doing, man? Never. Uh, I'm doing good. Yeah, it's a little nervous. nervous. Here, yeah, you know? me too, yeah. bro. But I'm hey, chilling though. Yeah, hey, let's let's it. break it down. You know, let's let's break the ice really quick and let's just get these nerves out the way. Let me just hit you with this: Cristiano or Messi? Oh my oh, fucking bro. god! Oh, man, uh, Cristiano Ronaldo, no bro, doubt. Messi, bro. Nah. nah. Bogart knows what's up. Bogart knows what's up. That's, that's, that's all he needed, bro. Cut this interview over. Bogart, <laughs> go ahead. And <laughs> Look, all right, I want to hear from both of y'all. Why, though? Why do you guys pick? Who do you guys pick? You go first, bro. I go, I go Ronaldo. <laughs> I'm a Real Madrid fan, so, you know, part of it comes from there. Also, Sorry, you know. <clears throat> what? <laughs> bro, bro, Real Madrid. Tony Kroos's boots have a better history than <laughs> Bro, <laughs> let him fucking defend his case, bro. <laughs> Chill. Yeah, so... Uh, in terms of like like working hard and all that stuff, you know, I've always looked at in an athlete like Ronaldo. Um, and then obviously, you know, all the Messi fans are gonna be like, "Oh, World Cup, World Cup," you know. Rigged. That's that's rigged, rigged, you know? <laughs> so fucking haters. Everybody. But you know, top goal scorer ever. You know, that's how you win games by scoring goals. Host, host who's every the, record the best in the Champions ever League, the, exactly. the hardest thing Mr. to win. Champions League, Mr. Champions League. <laughs> nah, bro. So World Cup, bro. That's all I gotta say, bro. If you're <laughs> a bro and you haven't won a World Cup, bro, it's like LeBron not wearing like a, a chip, bro. Like he can't be. Well, where do you then then yeah. let me argue that uh, that thing. Then would you put Kaka? As a goat debate, no, he's won I'm everything. Saying, he has a World Cup, but does he have? the podcast, bro. The podcast. Messy, <laughs> these messy fans, bro. Hey, right, the hey. folks. <laughs> nah, uh, that's that's definitely one way to get into it because you guys, as, as anyone that's not familiar, you know, Bogart and Nico here are true athletes, straight out fucking ballers. They're out here, you know. Yeah. Showing, showing everyone what's up in the field. So we're definitely gonna break that down a little bit. If you guys are not familiar with uh, with them that much, or you become fans after this, which you guys will, make sure you guys go to the description. All their links will be there. Their TikToks, their Instagrams. Go check them out. Go give them a follow. Go send them some love because you guys want to hop on the wave before it's too late. Facts. You know what I'm saying? That's true. <laughs> so make sure you guys do that and always like, comment, subscribe, share this around, and let's just get into this, bro. So. With, with that out the way, which we'll probably come back to it, you know, he, that debate just keeps going on. <laughs> um, how did, um, let's talk about what's an important key here, bro. The, the friendship. Uh, how'd you guys, have you guys known each other since like little or how did the friendship really start? Uh, we met at the Galaxy, playing at the Galaxy Academy. Uh, LA Galaxy folks. Yeah, I was, I was there first. Yeah, you were first. I was there first and then he joined the year after. Oh. And uh, yeah, that's how we met. That's how we made so, our... So we can yeah. hop on that right away then. I was, I was going to bring it <laughs> later. <laughs> LA Galaxy Academy. Um, how was that? Where did that start for you guys? Uh, um, so for that's, me, that's I, like the under the... Youth yeah. pro level, the academy, whatever. Yeah. Like, uh-huh. yeah, that's pretty cool. So uh, I'm a year younger than Bogart. So um, previous to Galaxy, I played for LAFC. T 
And then uh, I pop my my elbow. You're like, you know, get the fuck out of here. We don't want you no more. Oh, <laughs> they, 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 <laughs> kick you to the curb, bro. Yeah, but I, I got released. And then at that time, in LAFC, I was in seventh grade. So then eighth grade, I stayed like, cause there's a whole like academy league there. Yeah. There's the MLS teams and then there's like the clubs. Damn. So I played for this other team called Laufa. And then um, we were going to play Galaxy. And my dad told me the week like that we we're going to play them. He's like, hey, uh, you're going to play them. And they called me that they're going to be watching you. Oh, little scout, scouting. Yeah, yeah, scouting. So it just happened, bro, that I swear, like they passed me the ball off a corner and I try to cross it in. I whip it in. Bang it like that. Shit was light work. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but it, it was a cool game. And then after that, they told me to go train. Oh. Uh, I did. I was on trial with uh, with the Galaxy Academy for two weeks, but it was with the older. So I was like training against this guy. So you were that good, like nah, nah, like that. Nah, nah, to be nah, honest. Nah, nah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, from there they got me, and then I was there my ninth grade year, and then my tenth grade year. Okay, yeah. bro. How and how hard is it to keep up at that level? Because I'm, yeah. I'm, I mean, but for bro, sure, bro, we're, for sure, it's better than fucking like a Sunday league. We're, we're out here. We, 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 me and, me and Georgia in eighth grade, we were playing at Villa Park, bro. We thought yeah, we were, I used to play there, bro. Ah. Villa Park. Yeah, I grew up playing there. So compared to like something like that to fucking you know LA yeah, Academy, LAFC Academy, like that has to be a different thing. Yeah. But how about how about you? How because so that's how you you did really good in that LA like that match mm. that they scouted you like yo mm. you're moving here. How did you get in there then? Uh, the year before I joined the Galaxy, I was playing for a club called Rosso Cal, right? And that year I went crazy, bro. Like I was Ew. national team. I was yeah. everything, bro. National so, team. Wait, hold on. What do you like? So I played for the U.S. national team. Uh, I played at the U14 level and U15 oh, level. Oh, shit. Wow. God damn. Insane. Yeah, so that, that year was really good for me. And um, in that league, like where Russell Cal played, they also played against the Galaxy. Oh, okay. So I played against them like two or three times, like throughout the season. And every time I played you them, just bro, balled out. Yeah, balled out. Like, uh, their sec- the second time we played them, I scored two against them, bro. Oh. Yeah, so I was going crazy. Like young heard me, bro. <laughs> yeah, so then, um, so during that year, uh, they had been watching me, obviously, and they knew I was national team, and they were like, yo, when the season ends, like, we want you, like, just come. And then, yeah, bro, the season, the season ended there, and then uh, that's when I joined the Galaxy. Contracts right were given. Yeah, they didn't is even there, have to Is there contracts with. involved in that? Uh, Academy contracts, bro. Academy contracts. Yeah, but. Uh, can we go into that a little bit or no? Oh uh, yeah, bro. yeah. Yes. How how does uh, the academy contract work? Is there like, you know, fucking certain fees? Is there a, a salary involved? Is there this and that involved? Or like, nah, bro. Everything's free, so they pay for everything: wow. trips, wow. food, everything. So, uh, dang. Yeah. And the contract <laughs> just fucked up. I should have kept balling, bro. <laughs> the contract just consists of you, like, obviously being committed to the program, not playing outside. You can't play anywhere else, but you're just fully committed to the program. And it's like you, the contract is for a year, so you you're can't there for play the whole anywhere else. Like, you can't play a Sunday league. Can't play high school. Mm. Can't play anywhere. Oh, so so that so right? stopped you guys yeah. from playing high yeah, school. Yeah, that's why we didn't play high school. That ball. fucking wow. sucks. And like, in my opinion, right? Because I feel like all your homies, like, in yeah, high they school, all, they yeah. were like. Yeah. We Why don't you, you play? We need you. Yeah. <laughs> was your high school good? Was your high school teams good? So my high school was horrible, bro. Yeah, like, hey, hey, my homies are watching them. They need a Nico, bro. <laughs> <laughs> nah, yeah, mine was ass too. So. <laughs> it's not even worth it, bro, to be honest. Like, high yeah. school level. Com- and then yeah, like, if you have that option, level, mm-hmm. you have to take the account. And I'm assuming for injury purposes too, right? Yeah, that's what it is for. Yeah, That's actually really dope. All right, so then. Um, you know, you guys got into that uh, really quick because, you know, you're out here, like, you guys are ballers and all that. Um, for anyone that's curious, like, what's you guys' like, position? Like, as in, like, your, your go-to position? I'm, I, I'm a center back. I, when I met this fool, I thought this fool was a fucking striker, yeah, bro, like yeah, a winger, yeah. bro. That's how you play, huh? Outside? Yeah, yeah outside. That's, how, that's how you know. No, yeah, and yeah. That, we, gotta, we gotta get into that really quick, bro. So, for everyone that doesn't know, we have a little Wednesday league for fun, just to pick up games. And Nico shows up and starts balling out, bro. <laughs> and this is what I was telling you, bro. I Lafu showed up and made everyone look like he's out here at LA Galaxy level and we're out here fucking... Mascotas, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Cruz Azul level <laughs> youth they, team. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> I was saying this is for... So yeah, when I met Nico, I thought that food was like a winger, like yeah, like yeah, a yeah. outer like left wing, right wing yeah. striker. And then this is like he's like he tells me he's like, oh no, bro, I play center back in like in my clubs. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, yeah, bro, I'm out here sweating. <laughs> I'm out here giving them my heart and all, trying to go pro here, bro. This was out here looking like a, a warm up game. That's what we are then. Practice, bro. So so you're a center back yeah, by like in back. heart, like by heart, you would say. Um, well, the thing was when I was trying out for LAFC. I, I played in the midfield, so I was like, oh, okay. I, was, <clears throat> I was a six, 
And then, but when I was there, they told me that they had too many midfielders. Mm. So they're like, yeah, the only way we're, you're gonna get here, because I was there for like a month already, like trying out. I didn't get no response, nothing. They're like, if you want to have a chance of being here, like you gotta, you gotta try that center back. So obviously, like, you want to play in a team mm-hmm. like that, you know, you don't pay anything, like stuff like that. So that's when I started playing center back. Okay, but by heart, you you would say you're a midfielder. Oh, now, now I don't know oh, how to play you there, bro. Like you you <laughs> now, now you're like a true center back. Yeah, I choose it. Like, a, what is that? Like a number four, right? Number yeah, four, four, number, number five, five type of player. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, how about you, bro? I'm an outside back, bro. I started like off a as a winger. Back. Oh, okay. Yeah, I started off as a winger, and then I'm a field winger, so I'm outside. So you're like a full back, right? Like, yeah. left, you play left or right back? Both, bro. I can play you both. Play, yeah. Oh. Sorry. Got a little Joe Cancelo in here, bro. <laughs> I respect it. Yeah, bro. That's what's up. And then that that would be like a number twelve, number two type of player, number right? Number two and number three. Yeah, both oh, yeah. outside. Because I was look, I was considered number twelve, uh, like a Marcelo. Oh yeah, yeah, he's class, bro. Class, <laughs> Brazilian talent right there, baby. Exactly. Bro. So then going back to that, um, so how you said you were balling out? Were you scoring those goals as a winger during that time, or were you scoring them as a fullback? That year, I was playing both, bro. Because I was playing a year up. So I was playing with the O twos, and they had a solid right back. Okay. And um, so they would they would either play me right back, start me right back, and then I'll finish the game like as a winger. And then yeah, bro. So those two goals I scored as a, I was playing right wing that game. One of them was a, it was exactly like a, it was a cross. I tried to whip it in, but went right in. Post, yeah. like top yeah. corner. I remember that nice. in my eighth grade game. <laughs> <laughs> Straight like that. So that's what's up. So then now moving forward, you guys met. Um, he he got moved from. Like he got signed on and all that. Yeah. And then you said you got moved to the older group though, huh? Because it's like. So, yeah, the way it works there is in ninth grade or anything from ninth grade down, like you're with your age group, your own year. Oh, okay. Yeah. So right there was what, you 15, huh? Yeah, you 15, you played your year. Once you get to 10th grade, like you do school and everything in LA Galaxy. So like you leave your high school, you go there. Oh, yeah. So yeah. you guys did that too? Yeah, yeah exactly. that's, cool. that's how like I, I like really met him. Cause like the year before that, I knew who Boga was, you know, cause national team, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, 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 but but I never spoke to him, you know, because we yeah, wouldn't train yeah. at the same times. Who was nervous? <laughs> yeah. So yeah, um, let me get your autograph. <laughs> so yeah, in the the way it works, can we talk about like the high school? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, so so right there, you would go train at what was it? Nine. In the morning, yeah, nine, nine, nine in the morning. You train at nine to like eleven, and nine you go 11. shower. They'll give you like food and stuff, and then you'll go to school from I think one to four, twelve yeah, to four. It was like Couple hours, three hours. Yeah. Oh, two, four, bro. After three p.m., I'm out. Bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm not bro. staying there for four. But it was like the school was just one big classroom. Oh, you know, just like three tables. Nah, a couple more tables. It was a couple of tables, and then it's just all your classmates. Everything's on the computer. You have like uh, four teachers on every corner, what? just to help yeah. you out, like on every for each subject. Yeah, so for almost each like home homeschooling. Yeah, yeah basically. Much, yeah. Yeah. I'm and about Rose City. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, to be honest, bro, like, did it suck? Because like I'm, I'm aside from the soccer stuff, like that sounds like the soccer stuff sounds fun. Getting oh, yeah. you know, getting to play <laughs> soccer. No, but think about it, like you from that on the high school from an outside point of view. Like I'm looking at it, like yo, like where the bitches at? Yeah, where the hoes. Are. <laughs> <laughs> now, uh, and my question to that is: Is there still like, I guess, drama in a sense? Oh, between us? No, like, no, like uh, in high school drama. Yeah, if there's no beef between us. <laughs> <laughs> like, nah, but like in, in that in that in that environment, that's cool. Nah, you know? bro. Nah, yeah. nah. Everyone's cool. Everybody's just cool with each other. Yeah, we're all brothers, bro. So ah, uh, but was there long. was there a, was there a girl a girl academy too? They did have a girl academy, but they they weren't in the school. Uh, nah, yeah. no, <laughs> no nasty. Yeah. Keep the boys yeah. in there. Yeah. 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 Damn, bro, my boys. What if they started having second thoughts on what to do with that? <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, Bogart. <laughs> Meet me in the back. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, nah. But uh, okay, so then t- school was from 12 to 4. Yeah. And then after that, you get to go home? Yeah, mm-hmm. exactly. Uh, okay, that doesn't sound too bad. I just yeah. think about it like missing like, that high school experience. Yeah, and Fridays, there was no school. It was just training. Oh, so they had four days oh, of school. Sure. Fuck, that is better. Yeah. So that is Friday's better. Just three day, three day weekend, Friday, Saturday, <laughs> Sunday. Yeah, exactly. So then, um, was that? So you guys started that from sophomore year. You said was that all the way to your senior year, or uh, you, how long were you guys there for? Like, how did it go? My for you? my sophomore year, that was the COVID year. So oh, the when, oh bro, the crazy I'm thing that was old, that, bro. Uh, <laughs> oh, like no, the whole like, so that year, it's oh four oh threes, right? Yeah. yeah. And like my the my position, like the people I'm competing against, like. Two of them like are pro for LA Galaxy right now, and then the other yeah. one is D1. Oh. So I got like no playing time, bro. Like, 
It was bad, yeah. Because yeah, my first year there, I was, I was playing a lot. Second year, I didn't play at all. And then it was it was March 12th, but like the day that the whole COVID thing happened. Yeah. That was my birthday, bro. Oh, that shit started. Oh. We got there, we were warming up. But like, you know what? We got to go home. We can't train. And boom. Yeah. And then from there, that year, I, I got released. Oh, got released man. Year. So your sophomore year. Mm -hmm. Sophomore year. Yeah. Mine was my junior year. So I was there when I, I joined when I was 15, mm. my freshman year. And then I joined the, I was, I started at the school, sophomore year. And then my junior year, the same thing, uh, COVID, COVID was started in March, yeah. right? Yeah. And then like a month later, they released most of us. Damn, They, they just called us and they were like, yo, like, it's raps, you know? COVID did fuck up a lot. How was it getting that phone call, bro? Because I'm assuming you guys are there. You guys are fucking was bro, it a on the top of the world. It was tough, bro. Like, because bro. Bro. they called my dad. So they ah. called my dad. They told, they told him, right? And then I was just chilling, bro, chilling in bed. He comes in and then he just breaks it down to me and I'm like, fuck, bro. Like I was on my phone, dog. I I literally threw my phone. Like I was hot. Like I was like I didn't know like yeah. how, like bro at that it's age. It's like your bro, dreams are almost getting yeah, taken exactly, away. Bro. Like and it's not even it wasn't really based on like performance. Cause that year I was I was playing really well. Yeah. My, my first year I played well. Second year I had I was in the same situation as him. I was playing with it was O threes, O twos. So I wasn't getting any playing time. But my third year, I was I was starting, I was playing every game, I was playing really well. And it's, it was just like COVID that fucked it up. It wasn't really like based on, I feel like performance, you yeah. feel me? So that's- That's like, so sad, And did they bro. keep anybody or they just like released They kept everybody? like five guys. Yeah, five guys. Yeah, bro. Are those guys pros now? Or like, are they kind of up yeah. there? Yeah, some of them are pros and then some of them are playing at a, at a D1. Mm -hmm. And would you guys say that's your dream? Like straight up, like would your dream be to go to make it out in Europe? Yeah, bro. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah, that's like our number one goal, bro. That's like what we work for every day, bro. Cause like, I mean, no dick, Roddy Che. Like, I've told this to in person. No, like, this was that good. Like, yeah. Now, obviously, I'm a joke to him when we go play, <laughs> but, but you know, to my eyes, he's, he's pro level. Yeah. Um, so it's like he's first round pick every time we do the Tims. <laughs> <laughs> that, that is true. Is Nico here today? Oh, I got Nico. Nah, but um, then that's that. We can talk a little um, a little bit on that too before we get on that because. The pro level would be amazing, obviously. Exactly. Who wouldn't want to be a professional athlete? Like, yeah. you know, if you're when you're in love with sports. Um, but after the COVID shit happened and you guys got released from the, the team, you know, time went on. Now, where did the I, I think you started first on the content created, you know, right? Like the TikToks. Cause I, that's when co TikToks took off, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. During yeah. COVID. COVID time. Don't, yeah. So, I was, yeah, I was just bored at home, man. I was training all day, just chilling at home. There wasn't much to do. And growing up, I would watch a lot of vlogs. Mm. Like I'd watch like Roman Atwood, Casey Neistat. I'd watch all these guys. Um, oh, this guy named Matt Sheldon. He's like a he's a he's a pro baller and okay. he makes like mm. content, right? So um, and I, I thought like my days were like really productive. Like I would work out in the morning, I train in the afternoon. Like I would do a lot of stuff. You feel me? And I was yeah. like, I feel like this could like motivate kids that aren't doing anything right like now. Inter that, yeah, like, entertain and motivate. Yeah, exactly. So. Um, so yeah, it was during COVID when I started vlogging. I was like, yo, I'm gonna vlog my journey. I'm gonna I'm show kids that like, no matter like what you go through, bro, like you could achieve whatever you want. So that's how I started vlogging my, like my journey, my soccer journey and everything. Mm -hmm. So for you, it was to inspire people? Yeah, bro, that's like that's my, actually dope, bro. that's my main goal, like to show people like my journey and show like not just the ups, bro, but like the downs, like getting released from a club, getting released from teams, you know, and showing that that everybody's journey is so different, bro. But um, but as long as you <laughs> 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 no, nah, but as long as you push yourself, bro, and you're determined on what you want to do, bro, like you could achieve it. Everybody, everybody's journey is so different, man. It is. Okay, yeah. bro. Everyone is, bro. And then um, so then you start with the content, and then you started off with just the pure vlogs. Theme. Yeah, just vlogs and like vlog number one. Videos. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's bro. how I started off. Yeah, exactly. That's literally how you started. Yeah, vlog number one. Do, yeah. Damn, bro, I'm trying to remember when I first saw it. I think the first one that popped out for me, I don't know what number it was. And that's the funny thing about TikTok, bro. Like, shit pops out for Facts. you. Facts, yeah. Like, yeah. for anyone that doesn't know, and maybe some of you guys, maybe whoever's watching this, you know him now. Like, you'd be like, I seen that much. Because <laughs> <laughs> um, it popped out for me. I think you were going, like, to a game on a school bus and shit like that, and I was like, oh, mm. this is cool. And, like, yeah. that, I think what you're trying to say, like, you inspire people. I'm, like, not in the sense, like, oh, I'm inspired to play soccer or something, but I was like, Damn, this is so cool! Like you know, oh, you're, it seems like you're having a great time. Yeah, exactly. The smiles around your boys and all that. And I was it'll like, be cool to interview him one day. <laughs> yeah, in my head, I was like, yeah, he's coming on the podcast. <laughs> Bro, I think I watched. I think it was like 20, 26, 24. Already getting out of bed, making some eggs or some yeah, shit. Yeah, I was like, yeah. like I was really like watching that yeah, shit, bro. Like yeah, I really bro. am. 
I feel inspired to make some eggs. Exactly. And shit. <laughs> yeah, bro, that was the go-to. So then, like, those got going on, and then that's how it happened because you know, throughout them, you always had the homie Nico on there. You would yeah. show him out and all that. And then I remember one day, bro. Um, uh, what's it called? No, like I mentioned, guys, earlier, we had our Wednesday stuff. We're out here on a Wednesday. And then the, shout out to the homie Derek. He goes like, yo, bro, I'm going to bring some, I'm going to bring a homie. He says, he's pro. That, that's exactly <laughs> what he said. Literally what he said. Literally Literally what he said. What he said. He's like, he, he's a pro player, bro. He, uh, he played for LA Galaxy. I'm like, nah. <laughs> I'm like, don't do that to me, bro. I got to put the headband on. I got to make sure I'm all good to go. And then he pulls up and I'm like, wait a second. I Recognize seen him. this guy before. <laughs> uh-huh. I seen this guy before. And then the first day I let it be because I'm like, hey, bro, uh, do you come out in like Bogart's vlog? <laughs> like, I don't like I just go up to someone like that when I yeah, barely yeah. meet him. It took like the third time where literally around like a day or two before you popped out again. Like, I'll pick him up, boy, Nico. And I was like, that's Nico. <laughs> yeah, but there's a lot of times like that, bro. Like um, our homie Donovan, he cuts hair, right? Yeah. And I was at his house in time because we were going to go to the game from there. And he's literally cutting someone's hair, bro. And he like keeps looking back at me. He's like, like <laughs> "This is the guy from from the vlogs, right?" Like, he comes out of the vlogs. He gets picked up. He can't drive. I was like, "Why oh. <laughs> 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 are they doing that yeah. to you, bro?" Hey, bro. Now nah, it's, it's just carpooling, you yeah, know. Yeah, so yeah, it's just safe gas, safe gas, bro. And then, um, you know, the vlogs for you um, took off and all that. And then, how did um, when, when did you get inspired, Nico, to like really hop on that too? Uh, during COVID, I was just doing like cringy shit, bro. I, I was doing like <laughs> we all, we video. were all, yeah. we were all, bro. No one but but me. like the whole vlogging thing, uh, I didn't really want to start it, bro. Cause I was like, oh, did you just copy, you just copying Bogart, you know. But then after you, you that, add like, your own um, sprinkle to it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah okay. so That's after what makes it, it cool. Yeah, Bogart was like, yeah, but like you should do it. Like it's your own vlogs. Like you know, people know you from my channel and stuff. Like his, his vlogs and stuff. So I was like, oh, right, I'm just doing fuck. Yeah, it, but you know? it's not like it's not like I invented vlogging. You feel me? Like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Or, like, same as a podcast. Yeah, everyone's yeah. doing a podcast. Yeah, exactly, everyone's bro. vlogging. Everyone's doing the same thing in the sense. It's exactly. just everyone does their own take. You know, mm-hmm. our podcast is raw and nasty and regular to the R. We probably get canceled any day <laughs> now. It's <laughs> stupid. stupid. Yeah, actually, it's, <laughs> it's our take on it. Yeah. And mm-hmm. just like how your vlogs are your vlogs and your vlogs are your vlogs. Yeah. I. I mean, I thought about vlogging one at one point. I was like, should I start like vlogging on TikTok too? Um, maybe you guys inspired me. I don't nah, know. Nah, bro, the YouTube channel, dog. Yeah, I used to be on the YouTube channel. I used, <laughs> yeah, I used to be like yeah. the gaming YouTuber. Oh, okay, okay. Those yeah. were cool. Those were cool. Yeah. Cool days. But Until- you, uh, Bogart, I remember on some of your vlogs, you were saying that your channel got taken down, right? Yeah, bro. My, my TikTok has taken down like three times, bro. Wow. Like, Do you know why? Yeah, bro. I, I'm so dumb, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, during my vlog, bro, I would always put this clip like where I'm shirtless uh-huh. and uh, like, the shower head's right here. Bro. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> like that showering, bro. And then I guess like TikTok thought I got like tits and shit. But it was like <laughs> during the clips and shit or like on your profile or what? Yeah, the, no, like during the video and then I, I shoot them over. I want to like <laughs> investigate them. I would post it and then like uh, like an hour later, it would get taken down and it said, uh, what did it say? Nudity. Yeah, Nudity. Uh-huh, exactly. Child Child Nudity. 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 Bro, it took me hella to realize like, why does it keep getting, I'm just like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> like, I didn't care, bro. Like my first account was like at 30K, got taken down. The next one, 26, got taken down. Then the last one was at 23 and it got taken down. Right, I'm not good at math, but that's somewhere around like 80K though. Yeah, 30, bro. 20, and then you said Damn. 20, right? Yeah, dude. That's 30 plus 20, that's 50 plus 20, that's 70, and if you add the six and the other one, it's like 80 <laughs> something K. Bro, <laughs> it took me that long to like realize that shit, bro. So where are you at now? I'm at 14 right now. 14, we're climbing up, yeah, we're climbing, climbing up. up again, bro. Yeah, nah. When you realize like it was the like his nipples, bro, he, he would always record, I don't know if you guys have videos, he'll be like this, he'll be like this. <laughs> 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 Bro, how mad, are you, how mad were you every time that shit happened? <sighs> Low key. At first, I was like, fuck it, yeah, I'll just make another account, mm. bro. But I was getting followers, and I'm like, bro, I'm putting effort into these videos and yeah. shit. Mm. And then my accounts get taken, I'm like, bro, what the fuck? Like, yeah. you feel me? Like, I'm not naked, bro. Like, <laughs> <laughs> the fact that it says child nudity. You no, know, yeah. They, they think you're a child, bro. And so it'll, be like, uh, it'll be like minor safety. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. What, bro? Like, hey, fuck them kids, bro. <laughs> <laughs> God, bro. Facts, bro. Shouldn't be on that shit either way, bro. Nowadays, TikTok has changed a lot, I've seen, bro. Really stricter, like, I mean, our video today, we posted one that she got that she got uh, muted. It did? Yeah, yeah. she got muted. I didn't even yeah. know that. Oh, we did say dick in there. Yeah, so. we said dick and shit. So <laughs> I, <gotta take> it <laughs> down. I get it, but it's like shit like that. Like, bro, nowadays, bro, like 
You got to make like two separate categories. There's like the kid side and then there's pure yeah. adult stuff. Yeah, and then grow up, little man. Grow <laughs> up. Sorry. Throughout the, the content creation, bro, where did you guys see it actually started skyrocketing? Like skyrocketing, my bad. Um, I don't know, bro. Just video started like, uh, I was getting like regular views, like, like over 10K. Mm. Like every vlog was just getting over 10K. And I was like, damn, people are actually like fucking with the vlogs. And that's why, I, yeah, bro. That's why I saw it like start blowing up. It was on my first account when I saw it, like everything was blowing up. Everybody enjoyed the vlogs, and yeah, bro, it's kind of it's kind of starting again, you know. And you're consistent too, bro. Yeah, like I try to fucking consistent. Yeah, I try to post once every day. Um, if I if I don't vlog that day, then I have like another like another soccer video or something else, like a funny mm. video like that I post, you know. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then how, how about you, Nico? What's your routine with that? Oh uh, well, the first time I did my vlog, like my caption was like first and last vlog ever. <laughs> I wanted to see how I was gonna do, you know. Yeah. And like the first video, it has like 11k right now. So yeah, I was like, oh, like, yeah, like I don't have that many followers. Like I could just like start building like, it up. You know, for starting off, that's really yeah. good. Yeah. So I just kept doing it from there, and like I, I get a good amount of views too. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I'm always watching them. There. <laughs> yeah. It's yeah, always like both of yours. Always yeah, coming but, up, yeah. Both yeah. Of yours. A lot of people comment that they're like, "Oh, Boris was on top of this." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So then, um, that's a good question because for anybody that maybe is trying to start vlogging you know i like i said i thought about it for a, for a second i was like i should probably try those daily vlogs but i'm like maybe my life's kind of boring i don't know or maybe it's like you know what i'm saying yeah or we don't play for la galaxy and shit. yeah bro, i don't <laughs> play, man, play la galaxy here bro. or like you know you guys tend to be very active on stuff and like so the schools thing is very important too like those are almost there every every time yeah how, what, would, what would be some like tips or how do you guys get over that fear you know because i feel like also at this point i don't care being on camera anymore right but there's a lot of people that maybe like how do, how do you guys get used to being on camera and like how do you guys like not do people like get, feel weird do people feel weird when they see you guys recording all the time now <laughs> bro sometimes i like for youtube like i, I barely started vlogging like for youtube and yeah. sometimes i'm out in public and i'm like <laughs> i'm like a little like <laughs> nervous shy yeah. to like record you know but in my mind i'm like bro like nobody Ish. gives a fuck yeah. what you do yeah. bro like you just gotta do your shit dude like nobody's gonna be like oh why the fuck is he really like no bro, nobody's kind of normal to see just yeah exactly recording. in this time yeah. like nobody everybody's always like recording everything's on yeah. social media so mm -hmm. you just gotta get used to it man like just embrace it bro embrace it that's that's perfect right there yeah how about how, how, how do your parents uh feel because i know your parents are a big part of your vlogs too and yeah. family comes out all the time sorry like how do they feel about all that or you know they're cool with it yeah my parents are cool with it um and my my mom watching my vlog, you know, she be liking it. She's like, yeah. first moms are, moms are the best, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Are, bro. Like today, I literally came home and my and my mom was like laying because the door is right by the couch, yeah. and she was like laying down with her phone like this. And I walk in, bro. She's like reading the comments. Yeah. <laughs> 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 trying to see if she got a defense. Yeah. 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 See if there's anything. No, yeah. Is. Sometimes she'd be like, she's like, why are they saying this shit? I'm like, mom, <laughs> they're just joking. They're just joking around. But yeah, she be getting defensive. The internet is funny, bro. Yeah, I love so, you, mom. So, you <laughs> so yeah, shout out to mom. Shout yeah, out shout to mom. mom. I love you. Nah, my mom different. She don't be reading my shit, bro. I got so much fucking hate, bro. <laughs> she don't read that shit, bro. But um, yeah. So how's your family's like? Look at it. Like they they all love it and all that. They all be cool with it. Yeah, my, my mom's uh, she's very supportive. And then my grandma too. Like she she don't really know I'm recording her, but you know. Yeah, but shit. And then my little brother, he always wants to be in it. You know, Chris. <laughs> And then, uh, shout out to oh, shout out to homie. Yeah, I was seeing him too. Yeah, Is he yeah. better than you at FIFA? Nah, nah, no. Nah, nah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, um, that's yeah. cool. Has there ever been a time where you guys just run out of ideas, bro, or like don't know what the fuck to do? Uh, to be honest, no, bro, because. I mean, you're every day is your, different. Yeah, yeah your every life. day is different. So, like, I always got like something new going on. Even sometimes when I'm like, I'm like, damn, bro, I don't really got shit going on. Like, something just pops up, and I just mm. like try to like make uh, yeah. make something out of that. Yeah, exactly. That's sick. That's definitely sick. And then, um, how about with like uh, with friends and even like relationships and stuff? You know, like loved ones and stuff like that. Um, are you guys like your your friends are all cool with it too? They don't. I feel like friends don't give a fuck, huh? Yeah, friends. Yeah, don't. Yeah. They even ask. They're like, "Hey, bro, like, put like, let me mind. let me go in there." <laughs> like, or they do some like dumb shit yeah, just like, gonna to get make taken them down. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Now they're showing nipples, baby. <laughs> 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 so then, um, how about like? Cause I know, I know, with Bogart, you had a you had a very like yeah, exactly. Someone was someone was a very big part of your of your <laughs> of of the your vlogs, vlogs, bro. It gets better, bro. Yeah, it gets yeah, better. yeah. Well, well, I think I think we can talk a little bit on that since we're on that. Who comes out and stuff? Yeah. Um, you during your time when you were when you when you were make was it during your first account or is it with the 
Or, or uh, was she a part of every account too? No, I think she started like in the second or third account. Second, third account? Yeah. Yeah, because I remember like in the sense she was almost there in every every vlog. Yeah, she was. Um, Like what happened there, bro? Because I, I think everybody wants to know, bro. Like, About the breakup? Like should I get into like what you, happened? Go it's for it, bro. It's up to you, bro. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. We're going to clip this shit, so just keep right, it. Right, We're No, I mean, like I do have like a bunch of like of my supporters like asking like what happened and everything. So I guess... It's the time. It's the time. Yeah. Yeah. This, is, this is a tea to get into, guys. Podcast, bro. But yeah, so, okay, so me and, you know, my ex, we dated for like a year, a year and seven months around okay. that time, right? Which you guys meet in school or was because it's just... Uh, I knew her from like mutual friends. So she uh. went She went to a school that like all my homies went to. So all my friends like knew about her and like, I just like, I thought she was really cute and I was like, I follow her on IG. Hey dog, did you approve <laughs> from the start? Huh? Did you approve? <laughs> No, when I when I met him, he he was already with her, bro. So. Ah, uh, no, no, say, no, no, say. <laughs> but yeah, so then, uh, so yeah, everything was cool. The relationship was dope. Like I really love this girl, bro. Like I don't think like I've ever cared for a girl like as much as I care for her, right? Everything was yeah. cool, and then like, bro, like three months or like two months before we broke up. She uh she started telling me she was like oh I need space um, they always need you fucking yeah. why do you guys always need space bro? I need some space why do you guys always need so is that lying to rock this bitch yo <laughs> <laughs> yeah bro so she was asking for space and she was like oh I feel like my whole life revolves around you like I'm always doing everything with really you. and like oh, for shit. me for like yeah baby look at these numbers no yeah and uh and for me it was normal to like be with her like mm -hmm. every day like since we started dating we were always together we always do like hella activities like yeah. in the vlogs and mm -hmm. shit mm -hmm. and um so for me when she told me that i was like fuck bro like what the fuck did i do what's going mm -hmm. on you feel me and then um and then yeah bro and then we, we broke up she that was like pretty much the reason why like she decided to like break up with me she she's the one that broke yeah, up she with broke you. up with me bro yeah. so she told hey, bro. me nah you guys didn't break up she's she, broke she you're up <laughs> Yeah, so that's what she told me. She was like, she pretty much told me that she wanted to do her own thing. She mm -hmm. wanted to fly and she felt like. Like, like fly her. around, like travel? Huh? <laughs> nah. Yeah, she wanted to be a bird. <laughs> like, like, just like travel, travel the world. Cause I was like, travel together, and that's a vlog. <laughs> <laughs> that's a vlog. Fucking right. content right there. What are you doing? <laughs> what are we doing? That's what you meant by that. But I get what you mean, like fly, yeah. like spread yeah, your wings. Bro, <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, asshole. <laughs> <laughs> Dumb ass question was that? <laughs> I said she wanted to, to take a trip. <laughs> <laughs> she wanted to like do her own thing. Yeah, right? pretty much, bro. <laughs> and then. Bro, I ain't even gonna lie, bro. Uh, like a uh, couple weeks, like what, two weeks ago, bro? Yeah, bro. She got a new man. Oh, 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 yeah. That shit always fucking happens. Bro, bro. And it's one of her coworkers, bro. Oh, That's yeah. the worst part, bro. Her work boyfriend. That's her you, I, hey, 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 her head King. And you knew who that was already from the start, I, huh? I, you had I, a feeling already, bro, huh? Did she tell she, you not to worry about him? No, it's because she, <laughs> she started working at Walmart, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. at Walmart. Don't work at Walmart. Yeah, oh, Amazon. you fucking bum, dog. No Walmart, no Walmart. No Walmart, no Walmart, no Amazon. Fuck. Yeah. Oh, no shit. Amazon. You know what's yeah. up? You ever seen that one video? <laughs> Oh, Amazon workers were clapping cheeks. So I was like, "Damn, where yeah, do I yeah. sign up?" <laughs> so, yeah, so she started. Wow. Yeah, she started working there. And then when she started working there, she was like, "Yeah, I'm like, I'm meeting so many friends." Like she started going out with like coworker friends oh, and all of that shit, right? <laughs> and I'd be like, Damn. I, "Every time she go into work, like I drop her off, I'm like, fuck your job." Bro. <laughs> you knew some shit was going on. Low key, yeah. low key. I, I had a vibe, bro. And then and then when we broke up, I was like, I wasn't thinking about it, right? Mm. But now I'm like, bro, like. It was that all along, you feel me? Yeah. It wasn't, it wasn't. It was, she was looking for an excuse. Yeah. Exactly. It wasn't her trying to like, oh, I need to do my own. Like, yeah. fuck no, bro. You wanted like. You just want a new. Respectfully, bro. Yeah. Like, nah. <laughs> nah, 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 bro. But yeah, but it, it was, it hurt, bro. I ain't even gonna lie. It hurt. Cause I, I didn't, I never cared for a girl mm -hmm. that much, bro. So when it ended, I was like, fuck. Did you see it coming? Like, since the relationship, like, was there problems? Nah, bro. It was, it was always super chill. There was never any problems until, until she told me that. Until mm -hmm. she was like, I need space. I need to like, like you, I feel like you're a part of my everything, like my whole life. Mm. Yeah. And then that's when, like, for me, it was hard, bro. I mm. was like, bro, I'm used to seeing you every day. And like, you're asking, like, I try to respect it as much mm -hmm. as I could, but obviously it was super hard, bro. I was like, fuck, like, 
it's just weird not being yeah. with that person when you're so used to mm-hmm. that person. You feel and me? did you guys take, were you guys still together, but like spend time separate? Yeah, we, or? we would, uh, I would hang out with her less. Like I wouldn't even hit her, like I wouldn't hit her up. I wouldn't ask her like, yo, you want to hang out? I would mm-hmm. wait for her to like tell me, yo, you want to hang out? You mm-hmm. want to do this? Cause I, I don't want to be the one bugging or like, be the one asking her for her time. You feel me? There's always a W man, man. You like, there, bro. But yeah, nah, bro. It's all good, bro. But you know, I don't even know. I mean, I don't need to hear her side. <laughs> bro, the, the day how, he, how can the, she defend herself? <laughs> yeah, bro. The day he found out about like the the new guy. Yeah, Wait, bro, it was out? on game day, bro. We had oh, a game. Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. bro. It was oh, half time. Dog in him, son. You had to go off that game, dog. Bro, half time, and, and I look at Boba, and he's just like. I was chilling, bro. Like, <laughs> was that Mario meme or Joshi meme where he's in the like, <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I was chilling that game, like first half. I was, I was looking yeah, playing he good. Was up. He was yeah, balling. I was playing good, and then halftime, bro. I'm just sitting there and. But how'd you find out in halftime? Huh? How'd you find no, out? No, no, it wasn't during halftime. Yeah, but like, how'd you find out? Oh, it was uh my homie, <laughs> one of my homies. He's he's in the army. Hey, shout out my boy Gabriel. <laughs> <laughs> what a um, real homie. My homie's in the army, right? And I had told him when we broke up and everything. Man, he still followed her on IG, bro. And that day, I was like napping, taking like my pregame nap and mm-hmm. everything. I had my phone on, do not disturb. And then I wake up. I had a missed call from him, and and then I didn't answer because like obviously I was on do not disturb. And then he texts me right. After, he's like, you good? I'm like, and yeah. I text him like, yeah, bro, what's up? And then he calls me again. But at that point, like, I'm taking a shit. I'm getting ready for a game. Yeah, so I, yeah, I didn't yeah. answer, right? And then I call him back when I'm the I'm on the way to the game. And he's like, yo, bro, you good? I'm like, yes, motherfucker. Like, why you keep asking me? <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like, I'm chilling, bro. I'm you straight. Good. Right? And he's like, you saw you saw what I posted? I was like, oh. oh. I was like, nah, bro, what she post? And then he's like, he's like, oh, never mind. Oh. Oh. No. Fuck? I'm like, that shit. Yeah, I'm like, bro, how you gonna tell me? Like, <laughs> did you go like check that? right away? Huh? Did you go check right away? I, I don't, I don't follow her. Oh, no more. Shit, okay. I had her blocked on everything. So, oh. um, hey, hey, hey. who blocked who first? You did or you? Yeah, did? I blocked her first. I've done that too. But yeah. You just gotta take a little space now. Now you need your space. Yeah, and, then, <laughs> uh, and I'm like, bro, show me. And he sends me a screenshot, bro. It's it's just, it's of the guy, bro. It's of the guy, and it's like they're at a spot that I took her to. <laughs> That shit was crazy. No, no, no. I actually, actually, I want to. We're gonna bring her in now, bro. <laughs> I want to bring her. We're gonna question her, bro. Like, not on my watch. Not on my watch. Yeah, dog. That's disrespectful, bro. That shit was crazy, bro. He's not done yet, though. What else was on the? What else was on the stuff? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, there's more. Oh. It had like his little initial with the little heart yeah, and like a full yeah. song, love song, Jenna Aiko. I was like, <laughs> oh, oh, bro. I was like, bro, that is like that fast, bro. Like, bro. Come and you on. said like what, like three weeks or a month? You said it was like a month and a half after we broke up. Too fast. When yeah, when when it's like yeah, that, bro. Like, that way too fast, respectfully bro. and like, I mean, you know it by now. It's just. He was in the picture way before yeah, you guys bro. even broke up. And that's the sad part, bro. It's just weird. Women bro. are fucking evil, bro. Except for Kels. Kels is cool. <laughs> <But> women, <laughs> women are fucking I'm evil, loyal. bro. Yeah, bro. Uh, he picked me up that day because we were going to go to the game together. Uh, sad boy hours, huh? Bro, the car. sad boy hours. <laughs> I get in the car. <laughs> bro, at first he's like, bro, guess what? <laughs> <laughs> I was all excited I, I, about I, it. I'm like, I'm like, yo, in my head, I'm like, you know, like we're trying to commit to like college. I'm like, you committed? He's like, nah, bro, I wish. <laughs> and he's not like, Dude, this is get out of it, bro. Like, this is serious. I was like, fuck, like, what happened? He's like, my girl got a new man. My ex got a new man. I was like, oh. oh That's the so worst. Bro. Especially when you hear from your homie, bro. That hurts, too. Yeah, yeah bro. Yeah. This was hurting, too, bro. I bet. Yeah, uh, I was trying to cheer him up right there. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Special treat, right? No, no, no. Little pregame yeah. one, my homie. Little choopy loops. <laughs> but, um, you know what, bro? It is what it is, dog. Uh, most people have been in those scenarios. You know, yeah, bro, bro? I'm glad you're keeping your head up. She's definitely going to miss out. Fact I got one. you, bro. No worries. <laughs> yeah. And then uh, how, about, how, about, how about from there? Like, is there uh, is there any new girls in the picture right now? Nah, bro. I'm uh, right now. Uh, <laughs> yeah. nah. Why is my boy getting red, bro? Yeah. I, 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 seen, I seen a new face here and there on the vlogs, bro. Nah, that's just the home girl. That's just a home girl. But. <laughs> we just started as close, bro. <laughs> <right? laughs> nah, right now. Uh, just focus yeah. on your shit. Yeah, I just, I'm outside. I just got out of a relationship, so I'm just trying to focus on my footy, and that's my it. Footy, bro. I like that. What about you, nigga? You got any? Yeah, bro, I've been in a relationship for four years, bro. Yeah. Fuck yeah. you. Bro. Oh, oh, yeah, bro. This guy's oh, married now, bro. bro. Thank you. <laughs> you guys are locked in. Locked yeah, bro. In, yeah. In. 
Shout out to Shao, bro. Are you going to bring it to the vlog soon? Or are you going to yeah, really want to keep that separate? The thing <laughs> is, like, uh, she is she, not. Nah, so she used to live around here, uh, but then she moved recently. So, oh, like, okay. I kind of, I don't see her really often. And he don't drive. Yeah. Damn. Damn. Yeah, everyone, everyone uh, needs to like get out of their shell. Yeah, it took it took it, t- it took you a little bit too, right? With Trey, with Trey, yeah, the the driving. It was out of high school. Yeah, we should have yeah. done it earlier, but we yeah, kept like fucking around. Everyone takes everything. Kept bumming off the homies. Hey, I, got, <laughs> I, hey, I do, I do. Uh, Carlos driving school. I'm there. I'm Two a.m. at the Rose Bowl. Two a.m. Bro. Two a.m. Uh, bro. Two a.m. Uh, in the parking lot. Tell Camry, baby. The, yeah, the, yeah, let's in go. The parking lot. You know, yeah. late at night. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, I respect it, bro. I mean, yeah, that's good though. I'm glad that you got something locked in, bro. I mean, usually, I think after four years, you should be good locked in. How you were with your girl for a year and a half? You said, yeah, over a year. Yeah, I think if you hit that like three year. I think it's like, all right, we should be good. Right. We, we should, should be, be good. good. Well, anything can happen, bro. We're three oh. years in, like, we should be good for the rest. <laughs> the bitch we locked in. <laughs> That's what's up, bro. Um, hopefully, one day we'll get a, a, a Nico girlfriend in the vlog. Yeah. 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 fun. Yeah. But yeah, bro. And then, um, so aside from all that, that's what's up, bro. Um, you guys, uh, we're talking about like the, the games and stuff. What's you guys is like kind of like your schedule with game? Because are you guys playing? You guys play college ball right now, and do you guys also play club level as well, or like something so, club related? So college ball is from August to December. Okay, and then obviously there's like the whole break, you know, until August again. So then that's when they let you play with like outside teams. Also, co- when you're in college, you can't go play club either. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Nothing. Oh, wow. It's just college. I did not know that. Yeah. Well, that's the same thing as like trying to avoid injuries and all yeah. that bullshit. Yeah. Dang. During season, because the season's during the fall, mm-hmm. and then the spring we get it. Like in, in the spring, we play like a couple friendlies, like five friendlies mm-hmm. against like other schools, but that's when we're allowed to play outside. Like mm-hmm. for and right now, me and Nico are playing for a UPSL team. First place cool. right now, yeah. All right, right, right. Shout out Coach Rivas. We there, we there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was Coach Rivas. Wait, wait. You said UP, what was it? UPSO. Mm-hmm. UPS. Yeah. Like UPS? UPSO. UPS. 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 <laughs> what is it? United, United Premier United Soccer. Premier League uh, Soccer? United Premier League Soccer? Soccer League. And is that in like an academy club? It's semi-pro. It's semi-pro. considered semi-pro. It's considered semi-pro. semi-pro, yeah. Damn, bro. And yeah, you guys are playing that during the off-season of college, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. exactly, in the spring. That's sick, bro. That's sick. And you guys have, you guys have, so you guys play college together and you guys play that same club uh, level thing together, the semi pro yeah, Damn, bro. Bro, we've been, play, we've been playing together for a while now, bro. Yeah, that galaxy. That chemistry is three out of three, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, bro. yeah, we're cooking together, bro. That's <laughs> so and center back. You guys, yeah, wait, you guys play together, bro. You guys play left or, like next to each other? Yeah, right. That's so sick. Duo. Yeah. That's the duo yeah. right there. I let him do all the defending, bro, and I just <laughs> you, you want You wanted to send you the ball yeah, that you run through there. there that's the for real handle my lightweight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's so sick, bro. Um, And then I see you guys in the TikToks always like training together and all that. How often, what's like a training day for you guys? Because like for anyone that, you know, wants to reach the level you guys are in, you know, because to be honest, it's a ab- it's yeah. above your your average fucking Sunday league level. Of course, yeah. you know, people yeah. out here thinking just like a little Sunday league yeah. or something, or even to start preparing before yeah. you get any into that any level. youngsters, high schoolers or middle schoolers are like, oh, like let me get ready to get to that top level. Right. What's you guys' like training day like? Um. <laughs> uh, so when we're in season, it's like different because like you know when you guys see us like training together, mm-hmm. it'll be like when we don't have like practice, so we're yeah. just trying to stay active. But yeah. during season. Um, we practice, but we start preseason and like, it's like a whole two months, bro. Yeah, Sometimes there's before. like double trainings. So it's like 8 a.m. And then again, 1 p.m. And it's like scorching hot over there, bro. Yeah, bro, yeah. it's crazy. And then, uh, but once season starts, uh, we train in the afternoon, like around one. And then the games in, in our college uh, conference, they're uh, Tuesdays and Fridays. Okay. Yeah. And, and then we also train on Sundays at 7.30 p.m. I mean, a.m. <laughs> yeah, yeah, bro. And but you guys do like, oh my bad, what do you say, bro? I was going to say, uh, like for the young guy, like the young kids that are like trying to, you know, like yeah. get better at the game, yeah. bro. Like the advice that I would give is like get as much training as you can, like on the ball. Um, I know that like there's always someone out there working, bro. Like that's, well, that's what you got to keep in your head. Like there's yeah. someone, there's always someone like trying to outwork you, trying to take your spot wherever you're at, bro. So like never get comfortable, bro. And train as much as you can, bro. Because that, that's going to separate you from other players. 100%. Mm-hmm. That's why uh, Cristiano would be at practice like exactly. three hours. Exactly. Bro, he's the first hours. one there, bro. Last that's one to right. leave. The GOAT. 
Yeah. It's nah, still, yeah. Yeah. I try to get it's him there. Still no World Cup. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> That's crazy. Now, yeah, like even like at the JUCO level, like it's so hard, bro. Because oh, yeah. there's so many like talents that that didn't go like D1, and they mm-hmm. go there, right? Mm-hmm. And obviously in JUCO, like university is looking at like, oh, like we only have like one spot for a JUCO player. Yeah. So everybody's just competing for that scholarship, bro. Yeah, so bro. Those motherfuckers are hungry. Because yeah, when man. you're playing JUCO, those mm-hmm. motherfuckers just want to get out of there, bro. So yeah. those motherfuckers so are hungry. They're busting mm-hmm. their ass. You know, I got, I got, a, I got a question here that I couldn't like end or end or make this friendship. <laughs> oh I'm better. What happens the day that one of you like? Would you guys say a goal would be to make it together? Dude, yeah, that'd be, be sick, sick bro, playing yeah. pro together. Bro, the other day, I, I know uh, exactly where you're no, at. I was going to ask that too, but no, I didn't want to do that. that question comes in there like, we can only take one, bro. Damn, bro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm going to let the homie take nah, it. Nah, 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 nah. I think, would you guys be realistic? You'd be like, hey, bro, we're just going to have to do whoever they pick, right? Yeah, yeah bro, man. exactly. Yeah. Nah, and think. at that point, you guys will compete. Against yeah. Yeah, bro. yeah, even like even like uh, when we practice by ourselves, mm-hmm. like it's always like yeah, always like when we fuck up, it's like bro, come on, like what the fuck mm-hmm. you doing? Like, you're yeah. touch of shit. So you would like, say that you guys would really, you guys already talked about if it, if it ever comes to that, right? Which you know, let's hope not. But you guys are ready to literally be better than than one another. Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. that's how it is. That's how it should. And, be. and that's how it should be. It's competition, bro. A friendly competition. Yeah, exactly. And I mean. It's true. I mean, I everyone knows. If it's not you, you, you would be like, fuck, like it should have been me or mm-hmm. I wish it was me. But then you also on the left to look at my boy See, made right. it, you know? My yeah, exactly. Yeah. And to be honest, bro, any true homie would like figure out a way to bring you back in or, or yeah, fake as fuck, it. dog. Fuck, I'm like, fuck that fuck. <laughs> I was a bad <laughs> That's so cool, bro. And then um, really quick before we go into like one of our last things, um, uh, one of the most, I, I don't know, maybe the most popular, you can tell me if I'm right or wrong, but I know one of the most uh, um thing that gets a lot of people hooked on is um the i think you said juku products yeah the juku oh, products yeah. Mm-hmm. you guys do like a tournament right like at lab five yeah right? that's where i work so i work at lab five shout out to lab five where is that bro i mean this we've been talking about trying to pull up oh on there's there. one yeah. in pokoima and there's one in gardena i work at the one in pokoima yeah. how far george how far it's like 30 minutes 30 bro, minutes. Ah, nah, we're not gonna not pull up one there bro. Not that so we're gonna when's the next tournament bro so we actually nfc is gonna join it's gonna yeah, be us here you guys make it to you no no it'd be it'd be complicated but Maybe for that, maybe for that, a little sweet action FC. No, yeah, bro. Uh, when you guys say Juke products, are you guys, is that like a team you guys created or is that like an actual team that like you guys are playing for? No, it's a, uh, we, we call it Juco products because mm-hmm. like, uh, say when a, when a player commits like to a D1 program yeah. from a Juco, mm-hmm. they're considered a Juco product. Oh. Mm-hmm. You get me? So yeah. that, like, that's pretty much what we are. We're Juco, Juco products. products. Like, like our team is like our college team. Like we have that's a sick as well. Oh, yeah. mm-hmm. So, you know, when you guys see us pull up and you guys see in the final <laughs> Juco products versus sweet action FC. Yeah. <laughs> Don't don't be trembling. Yeah, don't be trembling bro. I'm gonna look at you, dumb. <laughs> nah, bro. But I look stoked because I know. So yeah, I've seen that you work there, and then yeah. uh, you go and play there. Um, yeah. Like, uh, you guys just won the last tournament, correct? Yeah, we did. So it's like a league for 14 weeks. 14 weeks. Yeah. So and how many days a week do you play? One or two? Just one. Just one. Just Every Thursday. That's good. Every Thursday playing the little game. Yeah, that's pretty dope. And then uh, how was that like the tournament phase? You guys won that shit, bro. Congrats, yeah, yeah. bro. It, thank, thank you, man. Thank you. Yeah. It was dope. It was fun. Well, it was like during uh, we had just ended. <laughs> Hold season. on, bro. This was said it was dope. It was fun. I would see the vlogs. These dudes are counting <laughs> <laughs> on everyone. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> yeah. sitting on everyone. I'm telling you, bro. Like you gotta like when you guys watch this shit, go search up their like like that Chuka products. These dudes literally play like if they're playing like. You know in soccer in FIFA where there's the amateur level? These oh, yeah. are like, on, like world class. legendary world, world class, class and they're going against amateurs, bro. No disrespect. <laughs> yeah, but it's like, yeah, it's, that shit looks fun, bro. No, yeah, it's dope. And it was like during the we had just ended season mm. and the 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 turn I mean the league had started. So I was like, I told him, I was like, bro, we should sign up. Like, it'll be fun just oh, to play yeah. on Thursday nights. And there was like cash prize. So we're like, bro, we're going to get that bag, bro. So <laughs> it doesn't hurt adding some yeah. extra change in there, bro. Hey, but Nico's editing on those, bro. Crazy. Yeah, bro. You edit so those? funny, bro. Yeah, editing. he would edit them, bro. Yeah, the sound effects are always so good. They're cracking me up, bro. Yeah. So yeah, make sure you, I'm telling you guys, go check out in the description, go to their TikToks, go look at, you got to maybe scroll a little bit through them because you haven't, that ended like a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, right? it did, it did. Mm. You might have to scroll a little bit. And when does season two start or the next season, my bad? Uh, we were going to do it uh, for like the summer season slash yeah. fall season, but it's going to interfere with like our college, college. right? So we're going to start it again uh, in December okay. for season oh, two. Okay. All right, so yeah. anybody in the, in the, what do you call it? LA County area. LA County, yeah. Yeah. Go check that okay. out. Lab five. You know, get a little juku in there. You yes. might you might lose, but it doesn't, <laughs> it doesn't hurt adding some change to their pocket if you want. To <laughs> nah, just hand it over at that point. <laughs> but that's if we don't join. Facts, bro. Facts, facts. Bro, let me tell you right here. 
You got. You, you, I hope you're. I hope you're. You, you guys know that He's you're sitting good keeper, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you're good, no, crack. No, hey, you're not signing him over, bro. You <laughs> see action product. Look, right, if bro. it wasn't for my fucking knee injury, bro, I would have played at the World uh, Cup, bro. We've heard this excuse of billions you're of times. You're bro. looking at the top three keeper in Pasadena. Sure. No, exactly. but he said top ten at first, bro. When I first <laughs> every, met him, he said top every, ten. Yeah, every after like three years, when he brings it up, he always moves up like two spots. <laughs> <laughs> Now we're at the top two soon, bro. Yeah. Nah, bro. You got the best goalkeeper in Pasadena here, bro. You got the best. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Don't get me started on me, bro. <laughs> best, best, uh, fucking right, it. right back. You know, you know, she looking for your spot, right here, bro. Right, right, right. And then you know, you got me. What do you do? I'm Cristiano Ronaldo. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> you Cristiano what do you Ronaldo do? I'm Cristiano Ronaldo. Left -footed. <laughs> yeah, Cristiano. Hey, think about a Cristiano Ronaldo left footed. They, they, somewhat game recognized game, bro. <laughs> <laughs> but, but definitely, man. Uh, make sure you guys go check those out. Definitely. Uh, I, I love, I love it, bro. <laughs> Why? You don't think I'm that, bro? Shut the fuck up, bro. <laughs> if I we train, show clips, bro. If we I train like they train, dog. I would have gone pro, bro. I would have gone pro. Well, obviously, but you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> I would hope you would go pro, bro. Yeah, I'm just kidding. I, 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 I'm, I, I, most people grew up, or not grew up, but had a good soccer like history, you know? So we all love it. We all miss it. But uh, yeah, I mean, definitely. Last thing, really quick, bro. You think George, as a keeper, if you tried, you think he makes it into the college team? Be honest, yes or no, bro. Don't vote. I, I think he's there, bro. He's there. I'm hey, telling you, bro. bro. If it wasn't for my knees, nah, he's bro. Actually, like he actually got reflexes, bro. Like, yeah, he's good. Yeah. Told you, bro. <laughs> we got it another keeper in the making, bro. So I mean, dude, he's working it out there, bro. Nah, definitely, bro. So make sure you guys stay and stay out for that live five. Check it out too. I've been wanting to pull up, so you exactly. might then, actually have to pull up. Yeah, you yeah and share, I got a quick question. Has there ever been a time where it gets really fucking heated, like on Dude, the court? This guy all the time trying to start <laughs> problems, bro. Oh, you're, you're like, you, you, yeah. you have, have you got into a nah, fight? Nah, no. One time, um, I wasn't playing with the Juco products. Mm. At, at my job, we have like a staff team. Okay. And they play like in the co ed, right? And we were playing, everything was cool. And then uh, the keeper on the t other team, he was talking shit to one of my teammates, bro. He was like telling him all this shit, right? Bro, keep in mind, he, they're losing like 12 to like three or oh, some shit. shit. I'm like, why is this guy talking shit, right? And then he fouls my homie, right? And then he starts like telling him like, oh, get off the ground, pussy, saying all this <laughs> oh, shit, right? Shit. So I'm like, bro, I'm not gonna let that shit slide, bro. So um, like the following player, bro, they play me a ball and he tries to like come tackle me, bro. And I like just dropped this guy. Like he falls on the ground. I cut it to my boy and he just slots it home, mm. right? And then when he's on the ground, I'm like, get the fuck off the ground, pussy. <laughs> <laughs> I, was like, I was like, you're talking all that shit. I was like, get the fuck out the ground. And then um, he starts coming at me, bro. He's but, like, what'd you say to me? What'd you say? To he's like, starts pressing me, bro. But keep in mind, like, this guy's like 6'3". Oh, like, shit. I'm, I'm, bro, I'm, I'm going to get fucked up, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like backing up. I'm like, yo, somebody. I'm like, I'm like waiting for someone to stop this guy. Nobody's right, right. right. my fault, my fault, Nobody's like, stopping this guy. I'm like, yo. Like, but that's like the, the closest one I had. To okay. But like, like shit talking gets crazy, bro. I remember one time we were playing Mount Sac. Mm -hmm. And bro, he was having a good match. Like it was, uh, it was a lot of defending, mm -hmm. right? There was like one v one and stuff. Yeah. And he was locking them up, and then like they started talking shit. And I'm obviously like, I play close to Boga, right? And I just hear him. I'm like, ask your bitch about me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, bro, bro. During the fall, that was like a common thing, bro. Yeah, like they would always, always bring up my ex. They would always talk shit. Oh, like, shit. Yeah, bro. Like even, bro, it was always the bench players, bro. They would say shit about my girl. I'm like, oh, motherfucker, y'all weird, bro. Like, that does, uh, that does, uh, that's hella weird. Cause it's like, and I mean, that's the thing about uh, content creating and just putting your, your life yeah, out there. Exactly. Internet. Mm -hmm. Everyone's gonna know about your life, you know? Yeah, it's it's like, open book, bro. And then, that's the only thing that sucks about it. That somehow, some way, people can use it against you. But then, yeah. at the end of the day, all you gotta do is, bro, you're the one that knows about you. Know me, I don't know you. Yeah, who, who's right. exactly. Who, who's yeah. a fan here? Right. So that's the way to end it. And then with that, bro, dude, like we're gonna go into this um, kind of like talk about fans. No, I'm just kidding. But we got supporters <laughs> out here, bro. We we put out as always our Instagram stories where we try to get people to ask questions and hop on that, you know. And we got a good amount of questions, so we're gonna spitball a couple, just go through them, some funny ones, maybe some serious ones. And then we'll get going, bro. So let's see which one we can start with. You know what? We'll start with. We'll start. <laughs> this is very like Spike. <laughs> we got. We got to go one right off the rip right in. Just. Just because. Why not? And this one, we'll shout out who it is. Shout out to the homie Trey Prem, bro. Shout out to Trey. 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 Homie, Trey Prem. And Trey. Trey had a good question. Just start us off with. <laughs> what is? Who? What's the best club in the world? 
Professional football. FC Barcelona. Stop. Ah, yeah. 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 Best Frauds. Frauds. Dude, haven't seen Barca play in the UEFA for like semifinals since I was in seventh grade. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Holy but shit. I'm a, I'm a Real Madrid fan, you know? Real Madrid. I love Madrid, baby. Madrid. So, okay. both sorry ass teams. We got Madrid. <laughs> you really think it's Barca? Yeah, bro, I'm Barca. Man. But like, like ride be, or die, bro. Be, be real right now. Like, so you know, put the be fan real. thing to the side. Okay, on, dead on paper, who's the best club in the world? <laughs> I'm Barca, bro. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I respect his loyalty. I respect his loyalty. That's what's up, bro. So Trey, you got your answer. You got there. The two, they are the two biggest clubs in the world, straight up though. Exactly. Barca and Madrid. It doesn't go wrong with that. All right, bro. Kelsey, you got one ready? Somebody asked. How many times a day do you guys kiss? Wow. <laughs> like a solid four. Yeah, yeah, probably like when he picks me up. <laughs> <laughs> Got to pay him somehow, bro. Yeah. We're parking, you know. Yeah. <laughs> In the park, yo. <laughs> <laughs> they have the little. Then the best one is when he drops me off. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, bro, if you're not kissing your homie, are you really a homie? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, that is, that is, I guess this is a good night kiss every time. Facts. I'm like, mm. <laughs> yeah. All right, John, what's next, bro? Somebody said, who gets more puss? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Who gets more of that pushy? Uh, oh, this was locked in. He's yeah, locked in. Yeah, he's at the moment, in. he like, you know, he's committed and shit. <laughs> yeah. so I'll, I'll, take the, I'll take that one. I'll take I'll that one. <laughs> I like that. I like that, bro. Cool, I have one. Who's had the most down bad moment? Ooh, I did for sure, bro. Why <laughs> <laughs> are you so hard? Why are you doing that to me, though? What do you know? This guy has been know. in a relationship since he was like fucking seven, bro. So like, <laughs> of course, bro. Like, nah, hey, I'm just saying, his, his girl's securing the bag, bro. Nah, hey, hey, bro. Once, hey, once my boy goes out to Europe, she coming too. <laughs> <laughs> I respect that, bro. So, hey, bro, so, so who's so had the most bad moment? I did. All right, bro, you, you gotta hear it. You gotta, you gotta hear it, bro. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> they too down bad, bro. They too. Uh, bad. That's all you guys need to know, then. That's, that's, that's going to be in our Patreon, bro. So make sure you guys <laughs> that's tap all in. You guys need to know, bro. Um, I have another one, real quick. All right, go, John. Then this is by three two three Nathan. Okay, did that's, Nico? That's my, that's my girlfriend's little brother. <laughs> uh, he said, "Did Nico really lose twelve three to his Stop. big homie Nate?" <laughs> I smacked that kid, bro. <laughs> Uh, it was the other way around. I was twelve. He was three. <laughs> um, here's a here's a more like a I guess serious or good one. Um, someone was asking. Um, Why did Carlos reply saying sup? <laughs> I always do that just in case. All right. So then someone has said this. Um, what like aside from where you guys play out in college right now? Um, let's say let's say this school wasn't in the picture. What would be a dream university or like college to play for you, that you guys would love to play for? Um, damn, bro. USC. I already know mine. <laughs> <laughs> USC don't bro. got a men's team, bro. Oh yeah. They oh don't. shit, really? They don't. Yeah, they don't. USC doesn't have a men's team. Do they it's have weird. a women's team? They do. <laughs> Fucking sex. All right, bro. <laughs> mine <laughs> would be UCLA, bro. UCLA. I, UCLA. I love UCLA. It's right next to home, bro. Everything's here, bro. Great program. I would love to be there, bro. Are their uniforms far, bro? I don't keep up with college ball like Low that. Yeah. They're, They're cool. cool. Little baby blue. Little, they tough. <laughs> a little baby blue can never go wrong. And they have yellow in there too. Yeah, they have a little combo. I like that. You have one, my bro. Um, Are you a we, have, we, have a, we have a homie that plays at Duke. Duke. Felix. Oh shit! Okay. Yeah, I think Duke would be for me. Yeah. Duke is that Duke University? Yeah, yeah Duke yeah, University. Bro. That's nice it. High school. And then um, another one that kind of got me, you know, interested, in, and then maybe you guys can tell us more. Did you, have you guys had any like bad uh, injuries before? Like a worse injury? Uh, I recently got injured, like. Uh, Couple months ago, like two yeah. months ago, it was during. It was like that's why he wasn't playing with the Juco practice for a while. Mm. Yeah, oh, oh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah, was yeah. it your ankle? It was my heel, bro. Oh, it was, so uh, Danny, you call me to come sub in, <laughs> <laughs> bro. Funny thing, I actually reached out to Neo one time. To Neo, no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Neo, oh, shout out Neo. Sorry, yeah, bro. Shout out, shout out. Oh, I, I think I saw him in one of the videos. He came out in the video, right? Yeah, he did. He did. I fucking shot him, bro. <laughs> Fucking Neo. Neo over me. It's because I, I was crazy. just thinking like who lives by there, you know. I remember you for guys sure, mentioned sure. he lives close ah, there, right? Yeah. That's cool, bro. That's why that's why next season <laughs> don't even show don't even don't even sign up, bro. Don't even sign up. <laughs> I got one. Cool. Hey, you got one? Yeah, I got one. Uh funniest moment together. Yeah, uh, we have, a, we have lot, a lot, dude. This guy's always joking around, bro. <laughs> you're, 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 you're the you're the clown, like yeah, you're, like you're the funny one. I would just be like saying dumb stuff, but whatever comes yeah. to my mind. Yeah, bro, but we have a funny. I don't know, like one specific one. <laughs> Is there too many? Yeah, there's too, too many, many, bro. Huh? We all have those. We all have those. Ah. Uh, okay, let me ask one. 
Do you like playing college soccer more, or do you prefer the academy? Um. Ooh, that's a good. Mm. One. Uh, I don't know. They're they're like where I've been at. Like they've always been like qu- quality programs that I've been mm. at, right? Um. But obviously, I do enjoy that in the academy. It's all year long. You have mm. you have a game every weekend, right? And college ball is like only in the fall. You're playing twice. Like you play a lot of games. You play twice a week. But in the spring, it's like, bro, like I miss playing. It's dry. I miss, yeah, you feel me? That's the only thing that I would say that I enjoy more academy ball because of every game, every weekend. Every yeah, weekend. I feel like for me, it's like now that you're in college, like you're older, you learn to appreciate it more. Of course. Exactly. So I feel like I would appreciate it more now. But I also do miss academy because like you travel everywhere, bro. Like, yeah, it's like different countries and stuff. Like oh, it was shit. sick. Wow. Yeah. If I heard correctly, were you in Vietnam recently or something? I was. No, nah, I went to, when I was in Galaxy, I went to South Korea, wow. Croatia, what the Italy, fuck? and then it was like other other uh, states around the country. Yeah, and all for the free? Yeah, yeah bro. What the wow. fuck did we do wrong? Oh, yeah, there, we chose to <laughs> send our asses. Bro, my knees, bro. <laughs> um, the very last question to wrap up these questions um and that we kind of went over it but i would like to kind of hear your final say is any plans to go play overseas which obviously we said like that would be the dream right what would be like your ideal dream to like you know do you would you say you want to start off already like in barcelona or would you like to maybe have a little like you know how you know how it is like the soccer life is like starting the bundesliga you know start of Oh, like yeah, the Holland yeah. thing, you know, he started yeah. in Dortmund and moved up there or started in like the the Portugal League, Porto, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Like, would you rather have that experience to make you appreciate your move? Because if keep in mind, bro, you move to like Barca, Madrid, you're not starting right away, bro. Right. Over exactly. Vinny or something like that, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. Or like something like in the most respectful way, you know what I'm saying? No, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Would you want that ideal? Just fuck it. Let me hop on Madrid and work my way up. Or would you want like that Ronaldo story where like you started in a small, big club in a sense? Because, mm-hmm. um... Sporting good is like a big club, you know, yeah, yeah. but it's not bigger than Madrid. Right, exactly. So that's kind of like my my final question that someone asked, but I took I took a little turn on it. What would be your ideal plan or your goal plan first? Uh, so I feel like for me, obviously, like the whole like Europe is always like your dream. That's the you know? goal. Yeah, that's the goal. But I feel like to start off, I would like my my dad is a really big fan of Chivas, bro. So okay, I would want to start off like somewhere there, you know. Okay. She was um, uh the Mexican league, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mexican league. And then um that that like really quick, do they play here in the US or do they play in Mexico? No, they, they play in Mexico. Mexico. But they, they have some games. Some games here. Okay. Mm-hmm. So yeah, I think there, you know, uh cuz like I know like obviously that was going to be proud, you know, supportive, but I feel like that's just like a very special moment. Mm. That would be very So dope. then um yeah, from there like work my way up from there. Okay. And then let's yeah. say what would be the the first club that you move to? Would it be straight out Madrid or would you want to have like yeah. a I like think like another club to like build your name more and then you what league? Madrid. I'm trying to get this Brent. info. I'm trying to get this the info Brent. now. Uh, so when it happens, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. so when it happens, oh, they spoke hard. it into the system. I'm the him, bro. <laughs> you going to the Prem, the like, Bundes? I feel like the, the fans in Bundesliga, like they're sick. They're bro. fucking hardcore fans. Yeah, they're you. sick right there. Fucking then, Germans. <sighs> yeah, I say either like Bundesliga, like a team out there. Yeah, I say Bundesliga, bro. Dortmund. Bayern. Dorman, yeah. Dorman. Not, not Bayern, nah, fuck Bayern. Yeah. <laughs> C-Trade, bro. Oh, that's how we, oh, we trade. <laughs> Damn, that, you just went from his favorite player to fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, yeah. Dortmund, nice little run there. And then the, the you know how the question is, like the club you start in, the one you you blow up in, and the one you become a legend. So you start in Chivas, mm. you blow up in Dortmund, and then would you want to be a legend in Madrid? Yeah, of course. Yeah. That, that sounds like a beautiful story, bro. How about you, Bogart? Uh, this kind of the same thing. Like, uh, I would want to like be at Academy. So, like, say here I played for the Galaxy, or I played for a Galaxy and LAFC. So maybe one of those two, or my favorite team in Mexico, which is uh, Pumas. Pumas. <laughs> like, work my way up, like through the Academy, make okay. it into the first team. You know what I'm saying? Make my name there in the first team, and then make a move to uh, maybe like, I don't know. The I was Prem, thinking about Sedia. I was thinking about like. You know, he looks like a steady app player to me, bro. Mm, nah, the Italian boy. Nah, prim, nah, bro. I was thinking how you said, like, moving to Barca right away. Okay. I feel like that would, like, maybe at the age of, like, 22, 23. So Barca signs you from, like, either Pumas, LAFC, yeah. or, or, um, or LA Galaxy? Mm, yeah. Okay. And then I'm there, and then I spend the rest of my career. Work, work there. Work there. Like a yeah. messy type of thing? Yeah. Almost exactly. like Julian Araujo, no? Yeah, that's, mm-hmm. what, that's, that's what, what I was thinking yeah, about. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. he started at Galaxy. He worked his way up to the first team. 
And then now he's at Barca and he's obviously working his way up. Yeah, he's, he's in the he's, second team, right? Yeah, he's mm-hmm. in the second team right he's now. He's going to work his way up, yeah. And then become a legend there. And exactly, all that. yeah, that would be That's cool. sick. And then a bonus question to finalize it. Internationally wise, you know, since you guys are both uh, Mexican, Damn. but I think there's, <laughs> there's an option to play for the U.S., right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which one are you picking? And realistically, bro, because who would you say has a better chance, Mexico or U.S.? <laughs> In the future, Bro. U.S. Huh? I feel like Bogart is different because like he's already been like at the national level. You get me? Okay, but I, I would choose Mexico, bro. I choose Mexico. Pa la raza. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, bro. For me, if I'm being honest, bro, like obviously I love my roots, bro. I love Mexico yeah. and everything, but, but. I, <laughs> <laughs> that's all I was waiting for. That's yeah. not for the raza, like, like Nico said. <laughs> 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 He's not invited to the party. So like kind of sad, bro. Kind of sad. Fuck, bro. My bad. Like Nico said, like I've already been like in the in the U.S. system and everything. Yeah. I know how it is. And obviously, like, bro, I would love to like. You know, I was born here, bro. Like, yeah. Hell yeah. everything's here, it's man. Represent. So uh, it makes sense. I would it's love to like bring like something back for my country for the, the U.S. But I, I'm, I'm not close to like representing the Mexico whatsoever, bro. Like, uh, this was like fuck them bums. Yeah. <laughs> in other words, 2030. World Cup final, Mexico versus US. Yeah. Nah, 2026 here in the. Oh, in it's the coming States. soon, too. <laughs> bye, bye. Soon, soon. Sheesh, my boys are calling in existence. Hey, I wouldn't be surprised either. 2026, Mexico versus US final. You got number four center back, <laughs> Nico. <laughs> and then you see over there on the other side, on the left or right back, Bogart. Damn. The storylines would go crazy. Sorry. Just no boys. I'm we getting free yeah, tickets. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we getting free tickets to the final, bro. But damn, bro. Any last shout outs, guys? Before we wrap it up. Shout Any out my plugs? Mom. Shout out my dad. I love y'all. Guys. My parents, I love y'all. My brother, I love y'all. Uh, follow me on TikTok, YouTube. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. All shout links out, in shout, out, shout out my mom, my dad, my grandma, my girl, you know, everybody that's been supporting us and Bogart. And thank you, you guys, you know, for yeah, bringing us out here. It was really dope, man. Yeah. We appreciate you guys, you guys. guys. for being here, brother. As always, yeah, guys, the link. Thank you. Everything, guys. Go drop them a follow. Go drop them a like. Go drop them anything, bro. Hop on the way, bro. I said it at the beginning. I'll say it for the last time, bro. Hop on the way, bro. Um, these, are, these boys are talented, and I right. really hope that they really make it to that top level, man. And they will. They will. Definitely. Definitely. As long as you keep working hard as the GOAT, Cristiano. <laughs> 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 John. I think it's we see put this episode away. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you pretty much wrapped it up for me. But let me just add on this. Of course. Fuck Walmart and fuck Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> fuck those places. Y'all can burn. <laughs> That's all I wanted to add, but I could just give it to Kelsey on that one. Thank you guys so much up, for tuning in. We appreciate them so much for coming out. Yeah, I'm never going to Walmart anymore. Fuck. Shopping right. at Target only. Target only. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. We appreciate you. Love you guys all. And have a good day. Peace. Oh, man. I got to cancel that online order at Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> I was there just like last hey, week, no, bro. bro. Egg that shit right now, dog. Tell me which one. Yeah, tell me which one. Which one. Which one. Which one.